Good afternoon and welcome to another episode of Discovering Humans. Today we want to talk about something a bit evil and lurking, something orange and terrifying, very dangerous. And no, I'm not talking about number 45. What I'm talking about here is a craze that's happening across the nation and it's something called Flaming Hot Cheetos. What we want to find out today is the mystery behind why children and adults alike are eating these fried concoctions. We want to take a little bit of a closer look into these crunchy corn concoctions and they're, they're, they're rather disturbing looking, they're, they're twisted up, they're lumpy looking and they're obviously very artificially coloured. Now why would somebody want to eat this rather than eating this? First we're going to start off by taking a closer look at how these are actually made. All right, we're in the studio here and we're all suited up so that we could figure out how this cheetah was actually made. We're going to deconstruct it and figure it all out. Let's see what happens when we apply some pressure and deconstruct this beast here. We see that there's some yellow on the inside, it's red and it left quite a mark. And here we've got the paper bag and the kitchen hammer. We're going to smash it now and we're going to see, oh yes indeed, how the oil is left here on the bag. We've got the same crunchies, crumblies. Now just after only a few minutes, look here how much oil is all over the bag. Every single little speck reveals a big oil blot. And of course that is refined, unhealthy oil here. starts here scientists and you have psychologists and you have taste specialists all trying to figure out how to make this tasty enough and how to market it to children and then farmers grow corn that's been genetically modified and heavily sprayed with pesticides now after the farmers harvest their corn it's dried and then they take the kernels and they're separated like this now that corn is all ground up and I've got a little mortar and pestle here just to kind of demonstrate. Now once the corn is ground up, it becomes a powder and then it's ready to use. Now water is added to that mix along with other ingredients. Once water is added to the dehydrated corn powder, we've got like a Play-Doh like consistency here. And what they do is they put it through an extruder, kind of like your Play-Doh toys. They stuff it in here, they push it through an extruder so that it comes out just like so into tiny little Cheetos. The Cheeto is then boiled in some oil and flavoured with some food colouring and there you have it folks. Out comes the Cheeto. It's made. And then it all ends up here in the supermarket when little kids are begging and screaming to their mommies, Mommy, Mommy, please, I want to buy the flaming red hot Cheetos and into the basket it goes. Now I want you all to notice something, that my hands are stained red from the Cheetos. What do you think is going on in your insides when you eat these chips? So knowing what we do about these flaming red hot Cheetos, why would people want to eat them? This little tea kettle is going to help us explain just how. When you eat a flaming red hot Cheeto, your mouth feels like it's on fire. So what happens is a message is sent to your brain and what it does is it releases endorphins which puts out the flame. It produces relief and then after that your brain releases dopamine which makes you feel good. Then you eat another chip and the cycle goes on all over again. Pain and then relief pain and then relief, it's the cycle that makes people want to eat more and more. It's a wheel that just goes around and around and around. Now these traffic signs here are kind of like leptin. Leptin is the hormone that sends a signal to your brain letting you know when you're full. However, highly processed foods such as Flaming Hot Cheetos turns off those signals so your brain never gets the message, stop eating. We're gonna pretend this little car here is a Cheeto and let's see what it does to those hormones that we call leptin. The switch goes off and you just keep on eating and eating. The result is people eat a whole bag or sometimes bags at a time. There's even a famous rapper that was sent to the hospital because he ate too many flaming red hot Cheetos. And that wraps up this episode of Discovering Humans. Join us next time.